box. I know what's in here, but it's been everywhere on the face of the planet. I've seen it on Instagram. I've seen it on TikTok. I've seen it scrolling through Pinterest because I still do that. It's been everywhere. Um, let me show you. Let me open this and let me show you. Sorry if you can hear cars in the background uh, because there are cars coming by. Grab a cup of coffee or a drink of your choice and a beverage. Sit back, relax. This is all about peace. No, it's all great. Let's ignore what's happening here. Hopefully this will fix it. Thank you. Mm-mm. I have a knife. Well, all in one. Be safe. This is not sponsored by any products being shown in this video. Um, I mean, hmm, they could sponsor me. I mean, hmm. Anyhow, that's, no, mm, we're, we're not sponsored, okay. Oh, this is like really thin. Like they got the box really close together, which is good. However, I can't open it because of that. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's shaking a lot. Nice packaging. You can't read this. some coupons. Okay, okay, okay. What shall we start with? Here, how about the samples? So I got this thing, um, just the like the two free samples you get when you order online or in the store as well. Um, and I got a lip product like that looks like the full size one and then these are just like the colors that they're offering and then a small brush how cute shall we try them oh dear oh you have to like peel it back so I'm not gonna get into this until I like need it. Then I have a eye brightening mask um, with SPF. Venti. Okay. You probably already know what it is by the title or thumbnail of this video, Ordinary. Um, the peeling solution. Um, I got this because I've been using apple cider vinegar um, since this, I fill it about this much of apple cider vinegar and then the rest of water. And so this is an acid base. I was using it for a bit to get rid of like a lot of the acne stars. However, it kind of stopped and it's not doing anything more. Like for three months, it literally has done nothing more to heal my skin. So I was like, okay, I'm going to move on to a different product. And I know this is acid base. It's kind of what the apple cider vinegar did. Um, so I decided to try it and it was seven bucks. Um, plus like shipping and taxes and whatnot, but like seven bucks, not bad. Um, I know there's like a, this is technically the knockoff version of another one that's like, I don't know if it's Drunk Elephant or something, but it's like 80 bucks or like a hundred something bucks. So this is technically the knockoff. Besides like the one or two like spots, like my skin's pretty clear. Right now it's a little bit red just because I, it, <laughs> it's been a long day, but um, I have a lot of acne scars. Since my skin used to be really bad, I won't, insure, I won't insert photos until like my skin's like completely clear, um, but I just have acne scars from that. And I've heard that this helps get rid of acne scars and uh, well, like helps 
minimize the look and that's kind of what I'm going for. Since this side used to be really bad, now it's just like right here. And this side right here used to be really bad, but now it's like just my freckles. Since I have a lot of freckles, so it's just like, I want to separate them. So, ordinary. I'm going to go clean my face. Okay, I'm back. Oh, um, I'm back. I uh, just washed my face. My face is a little red because of that. It is dry now. Um, a little bit red. Um, I did exfoliate my skin last night. Like, just with like, not like a product exfoliator. It was like, um, these brushes. Um, and like there's small bristles on them. They're soft bristles though, so it's like a light exfoliate, what I did last night. Um, it said it was gonna arrive tomorrow, but it ended up arriving today, but I wasn't expecting it to arrive till like later this month just because of like delayed shipping and whatnot. Um, but it arrived today, so I did already exfoliate last night. However, I'm gonna try it today. Um, and the lighting is good today, so I'm gonna do that today. So yeah. Um, I have to go pose for a thumbnail real quick, um, and then I'll be back to you. Welcome back to regular programming. Thank you. Um, so, as far as the smell, um, not the best. It doesn't smell like anything in particular. It smells like, kind of what it looks like. Um, it is like, sticky. Like, and I'm gonna put like the rest of it on. It's like, I'm afraid it's going to fall out of the container and not like end up on my face. <gasps> oh no, it landed on my jeans. Okay, I'm just putting a thin layer on at first. Um, just to see how my skin works with it. I don't know if a thick layer will change much. Um, in person it looks, on camera it's a lot darker, in person it's more of a strawberry color. Um, like if I had put on like a strawberry face mask or something, um, and like the bottle is more like purple in person since it looks like blood on camera. Um, and that's what a lot of people were like freaking out about, but in person, it just looks like a strawberry color with like slight purple hues and whatnot. So it doesn't look that bad. Um, yeah, it doesn't have a specific scent. It's not, well, maybe like a sweet, like the typical face mask scent, not like the actual like, oh, if it's cucumber, it's, it has a cucumbery scent. It's like, no, the like base scent of all face masks. It kind of has that with like a slight sweetness and like the acidity kind of scent, um, but nothing like drastic. I'm gonna go put on some chapstick because I'm worried it might get on my lips and my lips are chapped. Um, I'm also going to turn this off since I need to set a timer on my phone since I can't leave it on for more than 10 minutes. Probably like, only gonna, I'm not gonna leave it on for the full time just because it's my first time using it. So, yeah. Bye. Okay, so it's been just about 10 minutes. Um, I have to take it off now. So the sting isn't bad. Also, I'm used to it from the apple cider vinegar. So I don't know how it would be for someone else. Um, it's not bad. It feels like a regular face mask. Uh, like the sting, how some of them have like, just a light sting, that's it. Um, it is not a peeling mask. Um, since you can't, it, it's not peeling. It says peeling, but it's like a peeling solution. So I'm gonna take it off. It's a little hard to come off. Just leaving my face a little bit red, but not as, oh yeah, a little bit red. It doesn't hurt to rub it off. I know some like uh, face masks specifically like clay ones can hurt when you rub them off and it's not rubbing or pulling on my skin. When I take it off, it still kind of feels like it's still on. My skin feels kind of like tight. It feels like it needs like 
moisturizer. My skin's always right after face mask, so I'll give it a few minutes right off the bat. Um, on camera, it's really picking up, um, but like the ones down here are a little less like dark. I'm not talking about like the red, but like the acne scar dark, like brown is kind of plus, it's more neutral. Okay, so kind of still red. This is like acne, like these areas in my nose and that and that. Those are always there, but like the other air areas where my scars were are actually like a lot less like noticeable. I'm not sure what I feel about it. Um, car noises. I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. I will use it for a bit and update it later, so. Yeah. Hey, buddies. Y'all seem really cute. Do you want a new box? I have Ron right here. Here, I'll, I'll move your toys. You all look comfy, but. And, and then a, a new box. Stretch. There's a new box. No, no, just right here. Do you not care for the new box? Are you too tired to care? Are you gonna bite? Oh, it is cat approved. Okay. It's approved. Good job.